안녕하십니까 저는 파임씨입니다 모든 사람들은 잘하길 바랍니다 시작합시다 What's up guys? Welcome to my YouTube channel. It's me, Fire Islam. Hope you guys doing very good. If you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, subscribe to my YouTube channel now and press the bell button so that you won't miss my latest videos. So guys, today in this video, I'm gonna share with you guys 12 reasons why you shouldn't move to South Korea. So let's get started. The top first reason that you shouldn't move to South Korea is racism. Yes guys, racism is a huge problem in this country. If you are from any Asian countries, or like uh, if your skin color is different from their skin color so you are gonna be so they are not, not gonna be treat you as Koreans they are gonna treat you by your skin color they like to be with uh, you know from uh, anyone from Europe or America they love Europeans or Americans but um, if you if uh, you think about like uh, from country like uh, from where I've, I'm from ba Bangladesh or Pakistan India so they they don't like actually from uh, people from these countries so guys if you don't want to be victim of racism don't come to this country so guys, the second reason is Koreans are not friendly yes guys it is true Koreans are not friendly they gonna be friendly with uh, only with the Koreans or if it likes uh, if there are Americans or anyone from Europe like Italy France or Germany like that so as a result you won't have much friends in this country as most of the people in this country are from Korea so guys my next reason is what boring yes my next reason is loneliness or bored you're gonna feel real bored in this country if you wanna come to this country you must think about it so as a result what you're gonna have hard time living in this country so guys my fourth reason is bad people what do you mean by bad people so there are so many bad people in this country like uh, my korean friend says chon saram ichima nappun saram dege mana so guys, i'm not saying that everyone is bad no that's not the case there are so many good people as well so guys my next reason is getting a job is difficult yeah if you are in this country you must learn korean language if you don't know any korean like suppose i'm here as a student and i learned a li little bit of korean i'm not like my basic korean is good so i can communicate with people and i'm working at a restaurant so so that as i can speak korean my i can speak basic korean so i can communicate with them so guys my sixth reason is hard job koreans live for work they work 12 hours a day this country is from those countries which has the longest working hours in the world in vacation time i also worked 12 hours a day in a restaurant and it was so difficult to manage my time with the working hours i did cook at home laundry so many stuffs so my next reason is poor working culture hey dude what are you saying what do you mean by poor working culture it is a rich country as of i living in this country for four years and I worked at so many restaurants such as crab restaurant, meat restaurant, tofu restaurant, sushi restaurant, so many. So guys, in restaurants, most of the time I worked as a server. And what happens, why I'm saying their uh, working culture is poor is that like you are working as a server and like uh, they, they say you that uh, you go to the kitchen and do kitchen works too. Why should I do that? I'm working here as a server and I'm gonna look for the front side uh, the service for the customers why I should work in the kitchen so there are this kind of problems in their you know, working culture they're gonna scold you slang you saying motherfucker and that kinds of stuff and they may even fire you from the work I don't know why they do that kind of stuff if you have if you find any mistakes of uh, the stuff so you should tell them that don't do this way do that way or uh, you should not use that kind of bad words why you need to be so rude to the only foreigners i saw that not uh, they just only rude to the foreigners especially if you are younger than them no way they're gonna kill you they're gonna ask you every work to do so guys i think it's the huge problem of the people of this country lazy people you shouldn't move to this country because everything is very quick 
So guys, my tenth reason is no dustbin. You won't find dustbin around the road. So what I see here, so like people are throwing the trash here and there even in like bus stops. So everywhere you can, you'll find like cigarettes on the road. So this is the reason why people throwing trash here and there everywhere they want. So um, I will urge to the government that they should organize dustbin. They, they should have, the, have this plan to have dustbin everywhere in this country so that um, you can throw trash in a certain place. So guys, my next reason is smoking everywhere. So like here, male or female, every people in this country, they smoke. They do love to smoke and uh, they do even take break at work to just smoke. When I, I was working in a restaurant and like there were, uh, a, uh, there were boys and girls like uh, 20 years old and uh, there were also a uh, kind of like 50 plus women so like all they take are uh, like uh, when there is like break they have like 10 minutes break and then they go to a certain place to smoke so and like if you walk on the road and like uh, you can see people in front of you or back of, back of you they are smoking and uh, smoke comes to your nose and it's like i don't like it if you are a non-smoker you better not to move to this country so guys my last reason is fake nice yeah koreans are fake nice unlike japanese people they are kind of very similar with japanese people they are very reserved and like uh, they show you that um well they like you and they are appreciating you and they are smiling in front of you and stuff like that but in the inside they are very different they don't show you the actual thing they are very reserved they don't show you what's the actual thing they show you the opposite so guys that was the 12 reasons that you shouldn't move to this country but like uh, that was my experience living in this country for four years so like it's not like everything is bad every people are so bad it's not the case there are so many good people around here and there are so many good things natures beautiful places to visit so guys hope you guys learned from this video and will consider these things if you want to move to this country hope you guys like this video hit the like button and what don't forget to subscribe my channel See you on the next video. Take care and have a good day. Annyeong.